Welcome back, everyone. I hope you are ready for the pig race. It is about to start here at McMay's. I'm joined once again by Valerie. She is the co-owner here with her husband, Steve, and her son, Sandy. Okay, so tell me a little bit about what we're about to see. We're gonna have three pigs running out of a chute, okay. running around a track, and whoever gets to the finish line, which is treats at the end, the food, will be the winner. Will be the winner. Okay, I put my bet on Babe. The babe, pig, okay. Pig. Who are you gonna bet on? Cinnamon. Cinnamon, okay, and which one's cinnamon? The red pig. The red one, that does make sense. That's right, and Wilbur's the black pig. Okay, and there they come, their bell is ringing. Oh, the bell is ringing, okay, it's about to start. Cheer, guys! Woo! Woo! Here they come! Oh, they go! Oh, Who's in the lead? Oh, cinnamon! Oh, me. oh Wilbur! We're both wrong! Come on! <laughs> go, babe! Go. Come on, Wilbur! <laughs> we both lost. Oh well. Oh my gosh, where did the idea come from? The pig uh, racing. We seen it at a fair down in Texas yeah. years ago, and we thought that would be a hoot here, and it's been a hit. That is so much fun. <laughs> How often do you have them in the morning? Every hour on the hour yeah. when we're open on the weekends. Yeah. This time of the year for school groups, we do them two or three times a day. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we have to feed them anyway, so we might as well make them run. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. So along with the pig races, what are some of the other things that people will see when they come to McMain? Uh, we have the horses, as you've seen earlier, and we'll take you out to the pumpkin patch where you can pick your own pumpkins. Yeah. And we have about six acres of pumpkins planted. Uh, we have five mazes. We have the big playground, which is a big hit. Mm -hmm. And we have the um, McMaze bucks where you can find things hidden in the corn. Right. And then what do you use those McMaze? bucks that you find for us. As the kids dig them up, they take them back to the canteen and they win prizes. Okay. And it's a hit. Okay. <laughs> How much fun is that? Yeah. Okay, so what are your hours of operation? We're open daily from 11 to 3. Yep. Friday and Saturday nights, we're open till 6 to 9 for the Haunted North, which you'll see next. And and Saturday we're open from 11 to 5 and Sunday 11 to 4. Okay, and how scary is the Haunted North? Very scary. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so would you actually say that for young, young children? Yes. I wouldn't recommend they taking them. Anybody over 12 maybe, yeah. but nobody under 12. Okay, okay. We'll head to their website and check out all of the information, but coming up next we're going to take you to the Haunted North. Of course it won't be quite the same as spring, it's daylight, uh, but we'll give you a little peek at what's available to sure. children. Yeah. Because you've got something going on during the day for, for those who aren't quite old. Enough. That's right. The nightly haunt. Don't go anywhere. That's all coming up.